for patient review information, you can click review. Now this is going to show me the current exam. If I want to see all of the exams, I'd hit list. This only has one exam on it, but this is where I would show all the patient information. And from here I can sort by name or any other information by clips or images up here. If I want to review this patient, I would hit review, I hit and select or use that key up there. Here it says five of five, four of five, and this shows the images that we saw. And press play to review clip. I'd hit play and I would review the image clip there. Pause. I can print, go back to the list, delete this, or move on. Again, I'm sorting through the images here that I've saved. And this, if we saw the setup video, you saw that it said automatically save the patient information screen. It automatically is the first image in that, shows you the patient information screen that's automatically saved. I want to go back to list, and let's say I want to export this patient. I'm going to hit select, and I have some new options down here. You can export to USB, archive, which if I set up would go to DICOM or something of that sort. Page 2, I can go to print. Back to page 1. Let's say I want to export to USB. Again, I can scroll here and click, or just use this soft menu here. And I've plugged in a USB drive here on the side. It says my size and the free space. And it says include the patient information on the images and clips. That's yes. So I'm going to hit select. And it will export those images to my USB drive. When I'm done, I can click done. Again, we'll click review to go through that. List takes us to the patient list. And one other item is this info button. If I click on this, it's going to give the information on that patient. And if there's any DICOM of what the plan is going to do, if it's waiting to send to a DICOM server or if it's already been sent, that information will all be found right here. I'll click Done. So for reports, we saw this briefly before. I would just click on the report, and it's going to give me all the patient information screen there. And I can go to page one here. Oops, I <laughs> hit that too many times. And this is the any information I want to add on to a worksheet for that. Anything I want to add in for comments, I would just type right in there. Click back to the report. Go to page one. There's my information. And if I'm set up to DICOM, I click send report. And that would take me to, it would send that report onto the server. It does nothing right now since I'm not connected. Back to that other page. This is what takes me to this MSK, any of those comments. Go back to the report. Click done. And that concludes the basic training on the Sonosite Edge portable ultrasound machine. Thanks for watching.